What's going on? It's Legend of Two Games, repping for real fans, real talk. Make sure you're tuning in every Thursday night, 8 p.m. Also, check out the new website, man, realfansrealtalk.com. We gave it a whole new makeover. It looks great, and I think you guys are going to love it. But I definitely want to get into this Patrick Mahomes injury that took place last night on Thursday night. First and foremost, man, as fans of the game, it's very unfortunate. We all love to watch him play. I'm, I'm not even a Chiefs fan, but if I know they're playing on national TV, I'm tuning in. And um, that's, you know, we want him to get healthy. We'll see you back in three weeks because the news was that it was no ligament damage. Thank God. So he should be back in three weeks and we'll get back to watch him throw some no-look passes. But I do want to um, reference and revisit a blog that I wrote last year. It's up on the site, realfansrealtalk.com again. Um, I talked about how everyone was anointing this team and saying they'll get it next year. When they lost in overtime to the Patriots, everyone wanted to say, well, their time is coming. Next year is their year. He's the next great quarterback in the league, and they have the potential to be the next great dynasty in the league. And I looked at it from the opposite point of view. I didn't agree with that. In the NFL, things change week to week, and I understand the importance of taking advantage of what's in front of you at that moment. And if you don't take advantage of it, you may never get a shot. We've seen it with other great teams who couldn't win at that moment, and they never got another shot. And this injury just further reminded me of how quickly this thing could turn for the Chiefs, right? Their defense is terrible. We've all seen it, right? We saw the Colts run up and down the field on them. We saw the Texans go up and down the field on them. We saw the Lions almost beat them, right? Now, we're watching Patrick Mahomes take a beating. Last three weeks, he's been hit, hit a lot. His ankle has been banged up since week one. The Chiefs got to do a better job of, of keeping them protected, but more importantly, the Chiefs have to do a better job of putting a better team around them. They've got to go get some pieces on the defensive side of things. They've got to get a running game so that this guy isn't forced to throw 40 times a game. But ultimately, Andy Reid has got to be better for Patrick Mahomes. You can't have your quarterback who's got a bum ankle doing quarterback sneaks early in the game against the Broncos. You've got to be better there. You can't have this guy with a bum ankle behind an offensive line that's getting pushed around and expecting this guy to continue to drop 30 points for you. The Chiefs got to do better because if not, their window will close a lot faster than a lot of you guys want to admit, man. Real fans, real talk, legend on two games. Make sure you're tuning in every week. This is Dion Grant from the New York Giants, Super Bowl champ, and you're watching Real Fans, Real Talk. Real talk, we as real as you 